Hello, everybody. I was recently getting into that very small project uh, to get my mojo starting because I'm recently back from Russia and I had to get my mojo going, kind of like entering into the craft world. So I started to work on these little clips, which I really, really love. I admire how it turned out, how it came out. I'm working on the planners right now, just trying to figure it out, that's why I'm not sharing yet. But I started to get like um, a little clips going for that, and I really, really love how it came out. So I ordered the um, uh, clips itself from um, AliExpress, it's already three left, but it wasn't that many, it weren't that many uh, in the first place. So, and this one I bought in 99 cent store, I believe, and they're awesome. They are like, uh, so many of them, and they're all colorful and gorgeous, and it was not expensive at all. And this one I got in, um, uh, Tuesday morning, but I'm not that big of a fan of it because it's really heavy and when you add something to your planner it's already heavy and um, it's getting it more heavy so I decided to do stuff like that on a small clip rather than on the big ones because it's um, getting uh, working more efficiently let's say I was planning to redo this thing and um, I was getting a whole bunch of trials and errors and I was um, uh, looking at all the stuff I can place on it around the house and look what I came up with. Let me show it to you. So first was this um, Christmas thing. I mean not Christmas, uh, Easter Bunny uh, eggs. What I got at Hobby Lobby and it uh, came out pretty nice. So it's just like sticking out of the uh, from the top of the planner, and it's great. I love that. And the other things I was getting at um, uh, Michael's at ninety nine cents bin, and it was like a bunch of them, and they were laying there forever. Um, I even got it, I don't know how many years ago, but I never got into them because I wasn't sure what I could do with them. It's definitely for uh, scrapbooking, like you decorate the page, but I'm not doing that much of a pages anymore because I got into a better, uh, cooler stuff, <laughs> what I like better. And I, I, they made out of wood, and they're really nice. So I figured that I could do them as a paper clips too. Let me show it to you. So all of them, all of them, all of that yumminess. It's uh, different trial, trials, trials, and versions. Sorry, I can't talk in the morning. So that's what it's coming out. That's how it's turning out. I think it was pretty cute, so it's out of those, out of those pile. And that is just a button, buttons, it's my favorite, that's how I use it all the time. I place um, the chain on it that you could hand a pen in there. Let's say you don't have room in your planner for a pen, or it's hard to stick it on something, or it doesn't fit. So you just do this, and it could be hanging from the outside, while this is sitting on a hard cover. So that's my discovery, too. I love that. That's my favorite. And another one was this full theme. So you grab the color out of here, and you place the... Uh, the designer's um, top here and I usually normally use E6000 for that just for you know steady, steadiness so the other the bottoms buttons is that really love that too and then the whole bunch of different 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 stuff from another um, um, kind of like a steady 
objects like that. It was a lettuce, alphabet lettuce. Um, and you could also made your name in there. I mean, your uh, first initial and, and such and such. And place it in your planner. And I constantly in need for the clips. Like everywhere. I go with the planner or paper or some kind of uh, notebook or diary. And I always need it as a bookmark. That's why I got into it. And I think it came out pretty cute. So it's that one. The wood one. And this one I got a pack a long time ago too. I thought it looks like a nice... But it's really nice to put it in a vase with the, um, I don't know, candy or flowers or something. It's just a decoration. But it turned out amazing. I thought it was pretty stylish, design, uh, like design kind of interesting thing. Another thing is from 99 cent store. It was a bracelet with a whole bunch of those uh, little trinkets or how you can call it charms. It looking pretty nice on it too. The other thing is a compass. I'm really proud of that. So wherever you travel, you get this on your traveler's notebook. And it's just amazing, amazing, amazing thing. Okay, and that is just a half pearl. What I used to have in my stash. I didn't use the whole bunch of them because I'm treasuring them. They are really good on any project. So I'm just getting them. Okay, that's that. And the rhinestone. Rhinestones. See, you could do so much with that and have so much fun. That's another initial. With the alphabet letters. I never use those alphabet letters. I, unless I make a hole in them and make them on a charm for Henner. Like as a hanging part in a charm. That's how I use them. And this is another with a cameo. Part of the cameo. So that's another one with a rhinestone. I really love them. I uh, that, that one. I use it all the time. Because it's like so bright and vivid. And the same with the other one. Oh my gosh, this is so gorgeous. Love that. Love that. This one, another, another trial. It's just a rhinestone, so it came on a, like in a package. And I made it um, as a, like a fold down, like a kind of, like a grapeish kind of thing. I don't know. Okay, that's, that's that. And also that trinket again from the bracelet, from the 99 cent store bracelet. So here and there I added a chain. For the same reason, in case you wanted to place some uh, markers in there or some kind of, you know, whatever you got to hand, you do that. I really love how it works out. And the other thing is that wooden, wooden trinket. It's from Tim Holtz, I think. Uh, 940 turns 40. So, I don't know. And this one is another one that says home. The same thing from Michael's, the chipboard. But it's not out of wood. This is out of wood. And this one is out of just the chipboard. And this one was from Natasha's Scrubber Corner piece. Very cute. And this is a button. The button. But then I added a chain to it again and I placed it on a clip, on a paper clip. So button is cool. Another button with another chain. And it's a really fast project and it really gets you going because you get so inspired. You see so many things around the house which you want to place on a paper clip. So when you get excited and all kinds of, you know, happy and all. So that's the button. Another button, close to the buttons. And this one I got in my local um, local fabric store, SAS Fabric. So they have a whole bunch of trinkets like that. And they're plastic, but they're nice. They're like, I don't know, 10 cents or something. They're really cheap. So I got that going with the chain too. 
the other thing is um, that pearl again, half pearl, red treasure. I think uh, it's from Natasha Scrubbook Corner on Etsy shop. I'm not sure where did you get that. And this is sort of another grapey thing. Grapes. The red ones. I really love it. That's a flower. Everybody knows that flowers from Michael's. And that one is a rhinestone I had in my stash. And this one is another rhinestone. The same pack, I think. It's recollection, I think. It's shiny and nice. This is a piece of mirror. I used to have it from the tiles. Like a tiles mosaic kind of project. And this one is another grapey. So, I have a whole bunch to go, like, let's say, this nice uh, board, blackboard, and uh, the, that heart with the chipboard, and all, a little snowman, and Christmas theme. So, it's so endless. Possibilities are endless, you guys. And it's so exciting and so nice, so cheap. All you're going to need is um, E6000, a couple of things from 99 cent store, a couple of buttons or whatever you find around the house. You're all set and all good to go. Thank you so much for watching me in this nice sunny day. Have a great weekend. Love you all, guys. Bye.